if I had a better apprentice today, could have um, done yeah. a bit better. It was going really good at the start. I think we were in the lead, like getting all the rail into place. Then things could, took a little bit of a turn for worse. Dylan, how did you go on this one? Uh, oh, I'm in a lot of pain. I love solar. <laughs> yeah, I mean, what we got combined 15 years experience in the solar industry, so yeah. I, hope, I hope we come first. Yeah. Oh, this is down to the wire. This is down to the wire. Let's make Come on, fellas. Welcome to the amazing racking race. Presented by Your Energy Answers. When it comes to solar and battery now, oh my God, you can't avoid a barbecue where somebody doesn't say, oh, I've got a 32 kilowatt hour battery and I got this in the solar, my efficient panel is this and that. Guys, really at the end of the day, your solar system is only as good as the installer who's put it in. We thought we've never put installers up against each other. And thanks to Clenergy who helped us organize it, we got three installation teams. And to make things a little bit more interesting, we gave these three installation teams three different racking systems and one of them was Clenergy. But of course those races, how do you know it's not manipulated? So you need a very good independent party. And we looked around and we couldn't find a better one than Nigel Morris, the industry guru. So take it away, Nigel Morris. Well, good day, everyone. My name's Nigel Morris. We're here at the Solar Training Centre down in Victoria. We've got a wonderful set of rooftops and a wonderful set of teams down here as well, who you're going to hear about in a minute. And the goal here today is to put three teams on the roof, simulating real life installs and to test the speed difference between these systems. Is there a difference? We'll find out. We've got team XTech Renewables here. My name's Ashley Branson. I'm the director and co-founder of XTech Renewables. I am Dylan, uh, apprentice at XTech Renewables. Excited to see how the systems go in terms of the speed to install. No competition for XTEX, no unfortunately. I've been installing solar as a company for the last two years now. Over here, we've got the youth, the guys from SolarGain. Hi, I'm Tom. I'm from Solar360 Australia. We're a solar gain distributor down in Hastings. I've been doing solar for about five years, and Casper's been in it for about three now. A uh, warm-up routine would probably be... Eight monsters. Eight monsters and a bit. <laughs> <laughs> and then down the end, not last, not least, Anova Energy. My name's Ethan. I work for Anova Energy. I'm Scott. Yeah, I mean, what we got combined 15 years experience in the solar industry, so yeah. I, hope, I hope we come first. As you can see behind us, the feet are already down. The goal today is to do quality, safe, and fast installs. So we're gonna be judging them now on that. My job is to be the independent judge to make sure everything is as reasonable as it can be and unbiased. I think it's gonna be an interesting day. I think it's gonna be exciting today to see which one of these systems goes down on the roof fastest. Geza from Clenergy, join us. How are you? Great, how are you? I'm really good. <laughs> so Clenergy have helped pull this all together. And, and what's the goal of this today? It's always uh, good to have some fun every now and then, catch up with some installers, but really we just wanted to see how our systems stack up uh, with others. We thought, let's find out. Let's find out. <laughs> so no, no sweating for you today? Oh, we do, yeah, we do a little so head, mate. <laughs> this is going to be great, though. It's a yeah. great real-world uh, test. You teams ready? Yes. Let the games begin. Three, two, one. Rack it up. Hey, let's get some things clear and explain the rules and the technical setup that we've got here today. Each team rotates through each of the three roofs that you can see behind us so that we can get averages across different roofs, different mounting systems, different teams. We're not here to test roof penetrations. That's a whole different issue. What this is about is about getting the rail down, getting the splicing done, and using the panel clamping systems. We're also not here to do electrical connections today. So none of the electrical connections will be done. So they've all got the same conditions to come across, grab their panels, hop back up onto the roof, and get them mounted down. Oh, there we have it. Nice work. Edgetex Renewables are done, they're out. Oh, this is gonna be a close finish. Really? Oh, this is down to the wire. This is down to the wire. Let's make those. Come on, fellas. Oh, okay. Soul again, just slightly. Nice, nice. That's quite fiddly 
compared to the other couple of products. I think we came last. Well, I hope we do better in the yeah. next one. We're gonna <laughs> we're gonna be hopefully faster on the next one. Probably a bit scrappy, a bit slow. <laughs> bit slow, yeah. The only down like big downside is for the feet, you've got two screws or two bolts you've got to put in. So it's almost you're doing double time per foot. Yeah, not too bad on this system. Uh, we won this one, which is not bad. A little, uh, little nervous for the next one, but should be good. Should be good. Kaz is here. Kaz, how are you? Fantastic, thank you. Kaz, this facility is amazing. This is my first time here. Tell us what you guys do. So we're a registered training organisation and we run grid PV, solar and battery off-grid qualifications for people to go on and get their SAA accreditation, plus some safety training as well. We're in Adelaide, Brisbane, Melbourne and we're in Darwin as well. And we've done over a thousand students through our training centres. Everybody needs more trained staff. Now come on down here to the Solar Training Centre. You can jump online and register. Jump online and register, absolutely. We're ready for round two. We've swapped the teams. We're getting ready. We're going three, two, one, rack them up. Working together. They're the first ones off the roof this time. Oh, a bit of good teamwork there. Oh, solid guys are looking cool, calm and collected this time. Watching the guys up there that's struggling to get clamp going really careful to that clamp on a little bit. Make a good pace. It's a close run race between them. There's wins and losses in every one of these systems. Oh, and we have a winner. We've got one team down. Nice alignment, that's pretty good. Oh! Are you okay? Yeah. Good. <laughs> Clamp is causing the problem. Doesn't want to go in. Okay. And we're done. Alright. Woo! Dylan, how do you think you went on that one? Ah, oh, pretty good. Uh, no mistakes. I think it was pretty, pretty perfect uh, install. <laughs> so we, we did have a mishap here. This system went in beautifully. Really, really keen to win, and unfortunately, it was a stumble on the end. And uh, the old Milwaukee, not so good on the front of the solar panel. Maybe might have fallen, but uh, yeah. Besides the little mistakes of you know the competition and the rushing, this system's not too bad. It is a bit longer to install in terms of there's two screws to install on every single foot, um, so it's almost double the work of other racking systems where they only have one screw or bolt to install the racking. It was going really good at the start. I think we were in the lead, like getting all the rail into place. Then things took a little bit of a turn for worse. We started struggling with some of the top mids. Everyone seems to be battling a little bit with this one. The problem always seems to be these clamps. There's a bit of fiddliness in that. Hopefully the next one will be a lot better. We came first, went down really easy, really quick. Hopefully the next challenges will go just as smooth. Bag some more firsts. <laughs> I'm first again. <laughs> Hopefully. Yeah. <laughs> well, there's been lessons learned here today, no. right? It's quite strong if people fall on it. That's good news. <laughs> X-Techs are in the lead, and Nova's coming second, and the young fellas from Solargate. That's right. I thought, they were gonna, I thought they were going to be right up front, but they've got some work to do. They can make up some time this time. Yeah, that's right. We're down to the final round, so this is it. Everyone's swapped over again to a different racking system. Teams, are we ready to go? With a countdown, it's three, two, one. Rack it up. They're moving at a good pace, they're all pretty similar. Boys from Solar Gain are making good progress. Oh, Solar Gain have got their first solar panel up on the roof. Nova guys are bringing the panels up. X Tech boys are moving, they're all moving very, very fast. You can see that they've been doing this a few times. Solar Gain are right on their heels, first clamps in. Nova are taking their time, being careful. X Tech are filled with clamps. Solar Gain are off the roof and the youth are finally going to catch up. Good work. And over right on their heels. Clip challenges. Again, clip challenges. We found a 
the box. Oh, you got a yeah, yeah, we got a fender. Yeah. Sorry. Yeah. That's all the, that's all the shards of alloy too. Dylan, how did you go on this one? Uh, awesome, awesome, awesome. <laughs> oh, I'm in a lot of pain. If there's uh, any industrial guys looking for a new apprentice, <laughs> hit me up. I love solar. <laughs> Came second, but uh, had a little bit of a misalignment, which never, you never want to hear. A little bit of misalignment on the clamps, you know. We're trying to show how quickly this can be done, but obviously the guys just got that one a little bit out. Where do you think you guys will be positioned after they finish the calculation? Uh, I mean, we're praying for first, but I hope second, yeah. at a minimum. By far, it was the fastest one for us. Yeah, it had a smooth run. I think we came out first this time. Yeah, Pretty much good. cleaner system. Um, Finally, might have brought it back, at least with a second place. Well, the amazing racking race is done and dusted, and boy, it was interesting. There were lessons learned all over the place. And Geezer has the results. Geezer, what have we got? Oh, wow, very interesting. So let's talk about the teams first, right? Okay. All right, so we have a surprising second place and a surprising first place, and the third place is how we expected it. Uh, so in third place, Solar Game. Team Solar Game. Well done, boys. Not really the results we're looking for today, unfortunately. If I had a better apprentice today, could have um, done yeah. a bit better. <laughs> nah, nah, props to the other boys, they did really well. And these guys really did an amazing job. They actually won the last round, so they demonstrated that they've got the makings of it. Lots of Canadian goodies in it. Congratulations. Thank you very much. Now we're on to second place, and of course, a lot of bravado from some of these guys, and the second place team is X-Tech. Congratulations, X-Tech. Round of applause. Congratulations. Congratulations. Lots of goodies in there for you. Well, not gonna lie, a little bit disappointed. We were pretty excited this morning going, yep, we're gonna be first, but can't be disappointed coming second, I guess. Um, you got the experience from Anova and you got the good team from Solagain. Thanks very much for the commitment. Only only team to leave blood on the table. No, right. Let's let's that's be it. clear, that was a top effort. And of course, the, what that means is that Team Anova, our winners for the day. Congratulations, fellas. <laughs> we wanted first place and we got it, so you can't be upset with that. Might not have been the fastest time on every system, but consistently up there with that experience. Yeah. Get a little power bank. We tried to get you a second one as well. Take your camping, <laughs> thank you. That's it. Well, I have to say, I was surprised. One consistent winner. And yes, Clenergy helped us put it together. But after that, it is a complete independent show. And that's why we made sure we had Nigel there. And whatever the result would have been, that's what you're getting. So as an end customer, make sure you pick a good quality racking. If you want to find out more about solar, about batteries, how to save electricity, the whole energy revolution that's coming, subscribe to our channel. Till next time. Please support the channel by liking the video, hit that subscribe button and ring the bell and check out all our other videos. Want more Energy Answered? Visit yourenergyanswers.com for quality energy products, tools and calculators and find your quality local installers. You're still here? I'll see you next time. Bye.